Hello, KGA Pirates! It's Mr. Mike and these goofy characters. I hope you're ready for another good reading lesson. Let's get started. Here's our question, why? Why do we have these lessons? Because we want to read. We want to be really good readers. And we want to write. That's why we do it. So we can read and write. And there's our vowels. A, E, I, O, U. We'll be using those vowels today. And then what are these letters called? The vowels. There's five of those. A, E, I, O, U. And the other 21 letters are consonants. Vowels and consonants. Well, let's use them to read. I hope you're ready. Are you listening? Are you watching? Alrighty. Well then, let's go. Okay, we're going to have some special words today, some big words in this story. And I want to show you those words before we read the book. This is one of those words. I know you know the beginning sound of this word. What is it? The very first sound. P, P, for P, the letter P has P. And you know the ending sound is T, T, the T. But I'm going to tell you this word because we haven't learned this yet. This is the word paint. When the A and I are together, it has an A sound. But you don't have to learn that now. That's for first grade. But when we see this word today in the story, I want you to know that that is the word paint. And here's another new word. That's a big word. Look at all those letters. What's the first sound? <coughs> and then the rest of the word is out. This, this word is count. Count. Like one, two, three, four, five. That's count. <coughs> now we're going to see another word. And it will begin with these two letters. G. L. That's a little hard to say sometimes, but that is gl, gl, like glass, and glow, <laughs> and glue, like we use the glue stick when we paste paper together. Glue. You're going to see that word. Now, this is a really weird one in English. W-R. You just forget the W is there. Because that sound is R. R. Just like the letter R. W-R is R. Now, in this book, you're going to see the word write. Like when you write words. That's how you spell it. W-R-I-T-E. Right. Okay? So we're going to see these words, but I wanted you to know them before they came up in the book. Here's our book today. I Like School by Deborah Schechter. That's the book we're reading today. Let's get started. Ah, there's the title page. I Like School by Deborah Schechter. The title page. You already knew that. Okay, I'm going to 
highlight the words in yellow as I read them. So you watch what turns yellow and listen to me read. And after I read it, then you read it. <clears throat> Here we go. I like to read. Yeah, see, he's reading a book. A book about a boat. I like to paint. I like to paint. I like to cut. And you can see him cutting with the scissors. I like to glue. Okay, keep reading. After I do. I like to count. There he is. He's counting the fish. I like to write. And see the picture? He is writing words. I like school. That looks like some of you after school, when you run to your mother to show her what you did in school. The end. Very good. Are you ready to read that? I've received a lot of videos of you guys reading, and they're very good. Okay, so you're going to read the book all by yourself. But to remember what to do first, stop the video. Stop this video right now. And then ask your mom or your daddy to make a video of you reading the story. Okay, so I'm going to play the story again. And I am not going to read it. You read the story. Okay, here we go. Here's our title page. Now there's the word paint again. If you forgot, you can look at the picture. If you're not sure what the word is, look at the picture. That will remind you of what the word is. Paint. I like to glue. I like school. That's another hard word there, school. Wow, good job. Okay, send me that video of you reading, and then I have another video for you to watch.
This one is called, I Love My New Toy, by Mo Willems. This is Piggy and Elephant. We've read other books about Piggy and Elephant, but I think you're going to love this book. And one other book. If you give a pig a pancake by Laura Numeroff. This is just like if you give a mouse a cookie. But this time it's a pig. What do you think will happen if you give a pig a pancake? Well, you're going to find out. You can listen to the story and you can read the words too. You can see the book too if you want. Or just listen to the story. Okay? Have a great day. Thanks for working hard. I miss you. Bye-bye.